a cake or a lasagna or anything else you want to in your new air fryer oven because this is from Kitchen HQ Ceramic Nonstick. 10 by 16. Oh my goodness, <laughs> the third dimension is what I really care about. Look at how deep this is. Wow, Chef Shahir Masood Alice, is joining us. This is incredible, because I'm gonna tell you, this is one of the first time I have seen Kitchen HQ do ceramic. Ceramic yep. is crazy yep. expensive for a reason. It cooks so beautifully. Look at that lasagna. So ceramic, Alice, let's talk ceramic. Couple things, number one, it doesn't scratch and it doesn't stick. So you can see I took out my cheesy, saucy lasagna. Oh, yeah. And guys, can you see that shot right on the bottom? Nothing sticking, none of the cheese, none of the sauce. So think about any other baker, whether it was glass or steel, where you'd have to worry about soaking, scrubbing. You kind of don't want to reach for that. You don't really use it as often because you, you, know, you worry about the cleanup after. Ceramic, non-stick. Throw in sugary stuff, throw in saucy, cheesy, whatever you've got, don't worry about the cleanup. But also, Alice, this lasagna came out of my oven about half an hour ago. Put your fingers on the side here. It's still yeah. piping hot. That's why hot. people love you it. You see the steam. Straight to the table with it. It's oven to table. Mm -hmm. You can see the steam coming off of my lasagna about half an hour after it came out of the oven. So ceramic is oh, great for that. holding the temperature. A half an hour ago, you pulled that. Half an hour ago, and you could feel with your hands. Well, I see it's the hot, steam coming out. And the steam out. is coming it's out. It's nuts. So look at the steam. Yeah. So talk about keeping your temperature, keeping things warm. Oof. If you're entertaining oh, a crowd, wow. if you're going to a potluck, if you want to take something with you, it's going to keep it warm. Look at the steam coming off. You know what? Even I think it's hard for you to see there. I will just tell you that, take my word for it, it's really awesome. I wish they had put a Isn't fork that out here for so me. So these are the attributes of ceramic. Oh, non stick. Here it is. There you go. All here, right. lunch is uh, yeah. served. It's Sunday. Since it's nice it's and non -stick, warm, it keeps its heat, and of course, mm. It doesn't scratch as well. Oh, Ceramic yeah. is the way to go. So Alice, this is our 10 by 16 size. I love this size because you're doing big lasagnas, mm -hmm. big pasta bakes. You're doing big sheet cakes, but cornbreads. What is, the, what is the height of it? What is the depth of so, that? Because that's, that's a great my point. favorite point. I, I, I see a lot of different size of your, your baking pans, yep. but they're all too shallow. This is really super deep. So for me, this is the perfect depth for roasting chickens or ham. You can mm. even do a small turkey. It's good, right? I'm making you, you an honorary do... Italian. Uh, there you go. I passed the wow. test. You could do a small turkey here. Mm -hmm. Depth is important. If it's too shallow, obviously things are going to fall out and right. make a mess. Right. If it's too deep, you won't get circulation in your oven to get beautiful coloration oh, on your whole roast so chickens, hams, roast beefs, all of that. So for me, it's the right depth, it's the right size, 10 by mm -hmm. 16. I mean, here, Alice, I've got two whole chickens. It's kind of a one pan situation. Mm -hmm. Your veg, your potatoes, your chickens. Like I said, believe it or not, you could fit a small turkey in here. And now this is your roasting pan. You so could think, probably fit in a 10, I would say a 10 pound turkey would fit in there. Absolutely, That's a, a, big a 12 pounder, pan. no doubt. You could do your roast beef, your hams. So, you know, a couple years ago, sheet pan dinners were all the rage. Mm -hmm. Why? We want less cleanup, we want to put the veg, the starch, and our proteins in one thing, throw it in the oven. But if you do it on a cookie sheet, and we'll talk about that later actually, there's some cleanup involved, et cetera. 10 by 16, you're doing your family style meals, you're doing your sheet mm -hmm. pans, you're doing your big dinners, big bakes all together. And you're right, the depth is key. Not depth too shallow, is amazing. not too big. You still right. want hot air to circulate around. Because if I want to pour some wine into that chicken That's or right. I'm doing a roast or whatever it yep. might be, it's gonna hold it. A lot of times you put a few veggies in there mm -hmm. and then there's no room for anything else. Lovely, yep. deep, you've got nice handles on this. It is substantial, but not so heavy that you can't pick it up. Yep. Uh, some of them can be just really crazy heavy. You have your choice of three colors. So we have it in the red. We also have it available in the um, turquoise color right there. Oh, is it only red? Only red. Okay, so these are gonna be your ramekins that we have available yeah. as well, which frankly, you need these. <laughs> I'm obsessed the ramekins with these are cool things. too because they're they ceramic. Cool? Again, the attributes <laughs> are ceramic. These are great for little, uh, you know, individual oh, yeah, little cakes, desserts, uh, individual cornbreads. Cor I was just thinking, mini mac and cheese. Perfect, right? <gasps> non stick. How fun are those? So, so those are great. Yeah. That's actually kind of a restaurant trick. In restaurants, we'll it. make beautiful individual portions of lava cakes, of miniature cornbreads to go with your barbecue. So, really fun restaurant trick yeah. to portion, make it look great. Ceramic. 
all of the ceramic is oven safe up to 500 degrees. We're talking about non-stick, non-scratch. They're really, really great. And they keep the heat again. Ceramic My is, is still hot. the best when it comes to baking. You can spend yep. so much money on ceramics. We used to carry a line years ago. And, and frankly, it was triple digits for sure. some of the ceramic pieces. But you know what? I think it was 15 years ago. I still have them. I love cooking with them. You are going to love cooking with this, but this is that baking tray. I mean, this is so deep. Everything, yep. if, if you're getting ready for Easter right now, that ham, yes, yep. goes right in here with this beautiful glaze on it. Um, Chef Jamie has done a, what did you call it? Dolce de leche Ooh. glaze on the ham. We're, we've got to get that recipe out of her. I'm going to arm wrestle her <laughs> for it. Look at how deep that is, though. This is one of the deepest yep. baking dishes I have ever offered. I absolutely love it. $49.95 in the red only. The lasagna, how and many times the has the lasagna spilled over in the yep. oven and just messed up your oven for weeks? Instead, look at how much space there is here because this is so deep that it's gonna work for you in lots of different ways. Again, ceramic is the way to go. And you know what? Talk about a dolce de leche glazed ham. Oftentimes we glaze our hams in something sugary. Anything sugary, anything cheesy, anything tomato saucy. I just showed off the bottom of my lasagna pan here. Nothing sticks. Mm -hmm. Literally a rinse of hot water, <laughs> and you're good to go. It's crazy. So oh, wait, wait, look at that. You know what you got to see? Look, even my whole lasagna is not sticking. My lasagna is dancing as I'm. Look at the other side of the lasagna. I don't know if we can actually. Can get you guys that see on. here? It's it, totally even them. my yeah. even my crispy That's, edges that is are not crazy. sticking. I mean, right? Wow. Yeah. So That's talk about easy cleanup, easy service. It's keeping its heat. Now it's been out of the oven for almost 40 minutes. Still hot to the touch. Still steaming And 10 hot. by 16 is a great size. Alice, if you recall, we had a nine by 13 size. Mm -hmm. Sold out like crazy. People love that size. So we went a little bit bigger. This is a great, great size for big focaccias, big, you know, family style dinners, Easter lunches, that kind of thing. Three flex payments available on this as well. Let me tell you what, you will be obsessed with ceramic <laughs> once you cook with it. And I think this is gonna be your new favorite pan. Yep. So many things you're gonna be able to do with it, but having the ability to do your lasagna and not have it all spill over and, and yep. bake into your oven, this is also gonna work, for example, um, some of your, if, uh, I'm not sure it will fit in the air fryer oven that I have coming up next, but you can use those little ramekins in there. Absolutely. So you're gonna love that. Um, what did you do there, what so is that? So this is just a little angel food cake. Think about your big batch cakes, cobblers, desserts. Again, sugary stuff won't stick. I've got a focaccia over here. You could do your savory bakes, your pasta bakes, and those big sheet pan kind of dinners. Two chickens with the veg, yeah. your hams, pro tip. You could put your veg underneath to elevate your protein, your roast beef, your chickens, and that hot air is gonna rotate around, get coloration, mm. cook your veg, cook your potatoes, cook your protein at the same time, and you won't worry about cleanup. I love it when you give us little hacks. That's the way, you wanna <laughs> elevate, whether it's your ham, Alice, your turkey, your chicken, put the veg underneath, elevate your protein. Oh. That's the way to do it. This lasagna could not be elevated. This is great. It's quite good. <laughs> but again, look at the space you get here. And after 30 minutes of being out of the oven, yeah. you still have steaming hot lasagna, which is absolutely crazy. $49.95 is your price on that. If you'd like to add in the ramekins, we have the ramekins available for you as well.